All glories to Sri Sri Guru and Goranga. Welcome dear friends to another new video. This one is on faster VFT. You may have heard of EFT, that is Emotional Freedom Techniques. This one is Vaishnav Freedom Techniques or Freedom Tapping. So this is the faster version. You, if you want to know about some backgrounds just go to the channel of Robert Smith Faster EFT. But this one is the Vaishnav version and it is very simple and it is based on the verse from Srimad Bhagavatam 10th Canto 14th chapter verse number 8. That verse is Tatinu Kampam Susamikshamanu Bunjana Evatma Kritam Vipakam Ritva Gvapubya Vidatan Namaste Jiveta Yo Muktipade Sadaya Bhag. So the translation goes My dear Lord, one who earnestly waits for you to bestow your causeless mercy upon him, all the while patiently suffering the reactions of his past misdeeds and offering offering you respectful obeisances with his heart, words and body is surely eligible for liberation, for it has become his rightful claim. And ultimately this liberation leads to um, the perfection of the soul in relation to the Lord and um, the loving devotional service. So, um, here it is very significant to understand that one who gives obeisances with heart, words and body is eligible for liberation. So we find ourselves in a not liberated state. That means we are reacting on some level either at the heart, means the inner feelings, intentions, etc. or the body all the words, you know, heart, mind, words or body, not um, in a surrendered mood or in a not accepting mood what life and karma is presenting to us. All this has happened in the past and it is stored in the memory. So what we do is we have three key sentences derived from this Sutra verse that is whatever has happened you know if you have any problem in your body or with a person whatever has happened it's your perfect comic arrangement you know we are addressing the supreme just say om for simplicity because this is going to be faster if the we call it om so um it's your perfect comic arrangement. There's a sentence one, you know, mark it, sentence one. Sentence two, it's a perfect learning lesson because it's arranged by the perfect um, person. Everything that happens is a perfect learning lesson. And third, uh, it's mercifully just a token of what if should of what should have happened. Uh, okay. It's mercifully just a token of what should have actually happened. So um, these three things are very important and this we're going to repeat in the process and um, in the tapping. But actually this is just sometimes to remind us the other time we are just tapping on these major points using uh, the affirmations OM and YES. Because the problem starts when we say no to something, when we put opposition. So the actual tapping goes like this. Let's say I'm having a tension in my left fingers, you know. When I go to bed, there's such a tension and I sometimes it disturbs me from sleeping. So I don't even know what it is. So I start like this. Whatever has happened, it's your perfect comic arrangement. It's a perfect learning lesson. It's mercifully just a token of what should have actually happened. Om yes, om yes, om yes, om yes, om yes, om yes, om yes. Peace. Om Shanti. 
Whatever has happened, it's just a merciful arrangement. Om yes, om yes, om yes, om yes. 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 It's your perfect arrangement. Om yes, om yes, om yes, om yes. Om Shanti.